this is our map. We are located in Central Asia between China, Tajikistan, Uzbekistan and Kazakhstan. Our capital city is Bishkek. Here in the corner you can see how we write our name, Kyrgyzstan, and this is our flag. So with here you can see the seven colors, which means that we have seven regions. How many people uh, live there? 6.7. Six per seven. So it's uh, it's quite a lot of people, but it's a big country. It's a small country. If we will um, uh, look on the map, it will be like a small dot. For example, uh, it will be like a small part of China. So the square is 198.5 kilometers, and 94 percent of our area is mountain. So we are mountainous country. The height average is 2,750 um, meters above the sea level, and 41 percent of our area is located above 3,000 uh, meters above high level. And in uh, Kyrgyzstan, everybody speaks uh, Russian and Chinese so, or not? Uh, so we are multicultural uh, people. Uh, we took a little bit from nomadic culture. We are, took a little bit from Is uh, Islamic culture and we took a little bit from Russian culture. We, our parents, they used, to, uh, they, used, they used to be nomads. So, uh, and we took, uh, majority in our country is Muslim. So we took some words from Arabic language and we were part of the USSR till 1991. So that's why we can speak Russian language and we took a little bit from Russian culture as well. So here you can see the national dress, one type of national uh, outfit. Here you can see we call it Chptama and this skirt we, uh, we call it Beldemchi. So it, we can open it and it will be like one material. So it's all handmade. Our parents, they were dressing it for just uh, uh, to make the dress uh, like complete, to make uh, the dress complete. It, 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 uh, it can make you warm or it can uh, protect your white dress or another thing. And here you can see the, another type. So this also another type. This is the national music in instrument. Uh, after like we can see and touch this one, this uh, this one called elechek and this one tebete. So we have a lot, uh, and this one just one type. Here I will show you the chess board. Uh, chess, it's the popular game like everywhere, but the most important thing is the figures because uh, the altar inspired by uh, the world largest epic poem of Panas. Uh, so in Kyrgyzstan many people play chess? It, it's popular like everywhere, like every country. So, but the, it's handmade. And the figure, I will show you later, like you can touch it. The figure is from the epic poem. Nice. Today is actually uh, the World Championship right here in Dubai. Yeah. And as a, I think it's a Russian guy trying to challenge the Norwegian guy. Uh, so chess, this is a chess expo yeah. also. <laughs> it's very right. important. And here you can see Are those that... Are those chess, chess board also for the chess board? No. It's, uh, it's like a small map, so you can see from this, this side. Um, this ancient Silk Road passed by Kyrgyzstan which provide us uh, to, to get a new opportunity to learn something, to share something, to ch share with our culture, to uh, l learn a new, new things. Okay? Here, the national toy. So nowadays, every child is playing like Lego, or dolls, or t mobile e games, but our p uh, children, they were playing with, uh, with Shibon. It's called Chukö in our uh, Kyrgyz language. We call it Chukö. They were coloring it in several, uh, several colors like red, green, blue, and they were uh, making competitions with it. It's all organic, like we're making it from uh, Shibon, from knee side, from the knee. And they, they throw them around? Or? Yes, so they, they throw them around or they can um, play, like uh, if I'm alone, I can play it. If uh, we will start play with you, we can play. Okay. Here on the board, you can on the bill you can see the export, our revenue, the ship. Right. Do you have a lot of sheep? 
Uh, yeah, we are using it because uh, from the wool, we are making the house, we are making the carpets, and it's very, um, has, it's very like good to use, and it's very healthy. It protects us from the cold, and it protects us from the sun as well. There's a, yes. a lot of uh, mining happening. Yes, uh, so uh, mining in Kyrgyz uh, like, and the more than 50% we are exporting gold. So our country works with uh, inter international companies and we're exporting the gold. Nice, and the okay. whole world buys the gold. Yeah, we're trying to do our work. So this is the, actually, this all you can see the gentlemen's, it's belonged to gentlemen. So it's horseback side, we are putting it, horse equipment, we're putting it horseback side and we're riding the horse. This one is uh, during the wars, our gentlemen, they were using to, to protect them themselves. Not only the gentlemen, ladies also, because we are nomad and every time we are on the horseback side. So this gloves, it's for the hunting. So our, uh, we were wearing it and we were hunting with the eagles. Wow. This one is the mask for the eagle, so to cover the eyes. So you hunt with the eagles? Yes. They're like your partners when you go oh, hunting? Yes, they're like our friends, like our parents they were hunting, but nowadays we're trying to keep our traditions and some of the, uh, like, like to protect some. Okay, yeah. I, will show, I will show you the belt. Yeah. This belt belongs to the gentleman if you can see, they are different. So our parents, they were wearing it and every belt has their own meaning, which shows the owner's statue, position, how they are rich or something like that. But it's not belong to the lady, it's belong to the gentleman. And here on the screen, you can see a lot of type of traditional dress. Nice, can you bring the microphone in the middle? Yeah, just a little bit. Okay. Yeah. Cool, all right. So, uh, how's the economy going in Kyrgyzstan and uh, uh, are all the six million people having everything they need or things are improving? So, as I said, we were part of the USSR till 1981. Nowadays, we're trying to try open our country. Nowadays, we're trying to learn another languages. Uh, so, we have a lot of students program to we can go abroad and learn. We're just uh, the, on the start of our, our way to develop con the country. All right, but yeah. with the help from uh, China, Russia, yeah, Europe, yeah, everybody uh, wants to trade with you? Uh, like, um, how can I say? So, we, our re revenue is gold, the mining, and some people are going abroad to work. All right, okay. Uh, so, what, are we, what is this uh, tent there that we Okay, see? I will show you. So, this is our traditional house in our language. We call it... Yeah, so the yeah right there, sorry. I can yeah, let's put it. Oh, oh, no, maybe, it maybe you can put it uh, like you know on your on your shirt. Yeah, something this like way? that. Yeah, there. Yeah, that would better. Be, yeah, that's good? that's good. Yeah. Sound sound one one. Yeah yeah. Okay. <laughs> I'll cut there. Okay. So this is our traditional house in our language. We call it Bazui. It's known as nomad's yurt. So you if you can see this all handmade. All handmade is and made of wool, sheep wool. So this this part is made of sheep wool, and this one is horse hair. So there is any nail and only two products. So wool and wood. All right. If you like, we can take off our shoes and yeah. go inside, and I can explain the how they were living inside. If let's, you like. Let's try. Okay. All right. So um, th there's all I need these. need to remove it. All these pillows. Uh, no, no, no. It's good. Okay. The pillows. The. So here uh, is our traditional house, as I said, and this is the uh, the imp imp important thing is shape. It might be bigger or smaller, but it needs to be round, and it needs to have the crown of the yurt. So I would like to show you the crown of the yurt. We call it tunduk. It's very important. Even in our flag, you can see this uh, the picture of the uh, this crown. So it means that every every single thing it uh, 
is connected up there. Yes, it's connected. So we need to be all together. It's holding steady. Yes, if we will remove it, it will fall down. All right. Okay, our parents, they were living in, in this kind of years, and it uh, depends on the f family, how big is it. So, for example, if family is big, they make, can make it bigger. And they were dividing it into two parts. The right side is ladies' part, and the left side is gentlemen's part. Ladies' part, they were having uh, this kind of pockets, of course, made of wool, and they were uh, keeping inside some of their household items, their belongings. And the gentleman's part, they were keeping inside their uh, hunting equipment, uh, like this ho uh, horse equipment. And I will, um, so I will show you that, just a moment. I will show you the traditional music instrument. So we have a lot of tradition. Oh, just can you cut this one, okay? Because it's wrong. <laughs> Uh, okay. You don't know how to play it? So play it. I, I can just show you how should yeah. I, yeah. So this is a um, uh, traditional instrument. Actually, we have a lot of music instruments, but uh, this is the most popular. So it calls kumus. Right. So it's like the sound like. Nice. And I can explain you. There we have yeah. a, another one. So okay. I can, we can touch and exp like. Yeah. Okay. And I will explain you the, about the carpet. Yeah. If you see the carpet also made by hand, sheep wool. Nice. So it has to be comfortable yes. and keep the, the warm. Comfortable, organic and it's healthy for us. Even if it looks like a thin thing. Thin. It looks like yeah. a very thin, but it's more, much better than the modern okay. carpets. And uh, uh, yes, and people can buy these carpets and stuff. Maybe yeah. that's like a market also yes. industry. Yes. All right. Okay. It looks nice. Welcome. Yeah. Okay. Grab this. Can I hold you? Yeah. Thanks. Oops. 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 <laughs> okay, thank you. There's a Chess match going on here. Right? It's part of the World Championships <laughs> at New Booth. Okay, so nowadays we all have bottles. We're drinking water, uh, we're drinking coffee. But our parents, they were using this uh, made of leather bottles. It calls Gökür. So it's made of leather and it keeps every drink inside fresh and cold. Our parents, they were nomads and they need to. Yeah, yeah, no, no, oh, it's good. Okay. They were nomads. Okay, yeah. they, our parents, they were nomads and they, uh, it, it was very, very useful for them. So go from another uh, place to another. So it keeps everything inside fresh. For example, they can put inside milk, mare's milk, water, yogurt, and everything will be fresh. Okay. Here you can see the National Jewelry. No, uh, National Day Jewelry authors was in, inspired by the nature. Uh, we are like, uh, we're trying to live with the harmony in the nature. We're not uh, against of the nature. So here you can see the historical um, statues, like historical statue. Yeah. Okay, and also historical picture. It calls Petroglyph in our, in our, in our, okay. There's 90,000 of them in Kyrgyzstan. Yes. And um, there was, th this could be tens of thousands of years ago, right? Yes. A long time ago. Here's the musical instrument. And one type of the traditional um, men's wearing. All right. Okay. I can show you the um, yeah. handmade um, something. Okay. Right. 
winning the match. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I just wanted to check who was winning the match. Okay. So that chest that I was uh, showing you, yeah. it's here. So you can touch and see. It's handmade and it's inspired by the, the world la largest epic poem of Manas. Some, some figures are from there, so... Nice. So, we have three, uh, three types, from uh, silver and bronze, made of leather, Ooh. and wooden. Wooden is here. No, oh, someone yeah. keeps here the bread. Okay. okay. And nowadays we are trying to keep our tradition to use the thing that our parents they, we were using. For example, this bag, it's also handmade, but it's new. It's also wool, it's also handmade. And I will show you the really unique bag, purse. Yeah, really, why it's unique? Because it, uh, it was uh, made by our, my maybe grand okay. grandmother. I don't, I'm not sure about the, the ancestors. Ancestors. Yeah, your your few yes. generations back. Yeah, yeah, gen yeah. Okay, it was made by ancestors. Ancestors, maybe. Okay. Yeah. It was made by ancestors. It was made by our ancestors. So nowadays we're trying just to keep the tradition and give the second life for it. So it's really unique uh, purse because it's really like historical purse. I don't know what to say. There's a lot of stuff here. And people can, uh, these hats? Yes. Traditional? Yes, uh, it's a uh, lady's hat. In, uh, and this one is gentleman's hat. For now, uh, we have uh, winter, summer. For example, this one, it's made of wool. But we can wear it in summer also. Which is very interesting. Like. It's organic and wool, but we can wear it in the summer. Nice. And there's more uh, carpets on the yes. walls? Yes. I will show you the small one. So, like in the yurt, but the small one. Nice. Is it handmade? It's handmade, all organic from wool. So you can even smell it and it smells really wool. Wow. And Would you uh, like to smell yeah, it? Yeah, I'll smell it. Yeah. Oh, it smells. It smells. It smells great. And uh, he, this is very like uh, artistic. You have it on the wall. Yes. Some uh, Kyrgyzstan artist made all this. Oh, it's handmade wall hanger. We're trying to keep the tradition, and we're trying to make small thing like a pic normal picture. All right. So this is the another. Te technique of making and this one is another so it calls kurak it calls kurak and uh, we call it saima in our language so saima and kurak nice and uh there you're giving uh, people the the stamps yes and uh there was just World uh, one thing I yeah this also is still going on but what i wanted to ask you is over there let's go this way sorry no. um i saw one of these panels was showing uh wind power uh, there's a potential to do uh, renewable energy, solar power in the country, maybe um, for the energy. Yeah. But uh, okay, you, there was somewhere you were talking about it, I think. Okay, but th that, that's cool. Maybe I'll cut it at this point. <laughs> okay, please cool. cut. All right. But uh, thanks a lot. Thanks Thank for the you. tour. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Just a moment. Yeah. We can. If, if you don't mind. Yeah. In our tradition, if uh, guests are coming to our home, we need to uh, give him a lot of food. We need to give him yeah. like a so small present. I don't yeah. have a very big present, but I can, we can end with, I nice. will give you the cards with our, with some cities. Nice. And the Chu Valley. Nice. And can we can we see do inside? It? Yes. So here is the photos. Oh. And the small information at the back side. Let's see the photos. Yeah, just a moment. There's a few. This, this. Nice. This is nice. And I could be using them as, as like uh, with information on the back. Yes. For each of them. 
Nice. I can put them uh, when I mail something to yes. people. Cool. All right. Thank so you very much. Can we make a new video? Yeah, it? I was filming right now. Oh, really? Yeah. But was it okay? I think uh, it's great. Okay. Thanks. Thanks. Thank you very much for the tour, and thanks for the gift. <laughs> All right. Thank you. Thank you.